it's Russ from Studio One Expert. We're at Music Mesa. We are still on the Presona stand. I'm still with Rick Navge. Rick, what we got here? This is our new uh, USB 3.0 192K recording interface. It's called the Studio 192. So basically what you have here is uh, eight Class A mic pre's that are completely digitally controlled. So you've got basically um, a digital encoder here that controls the gains. Um, you also have some really cool functionality like built-in talkback mic. You've got uh, dim and mute for your studio monitors. And you also have a mono button that'll sum in mono. Uh, you have two headphone outputs that each have their own separate streams. So you can you know, assign a different mix to each of the headphone outputs. And then if you take a look on the back, you've got the next six mic preamps. And they, they also are dual Neutrik combo connectors. So you can plug in line inputs as well. Then you've got eight balanced outputs right here and then a separate main output, which is controlled by the knob on the front. Yep. You've got BNC inputs and outputs. For clock. Yep. And then, uh, you know, uh, spit if in and out. And then you've got basically here. Um, Muxed yeah, ADAT. You've got the SMUX ADAT. Yep. So you yep. can do uh, 16 channels at 48K, up to 48K. Or, or eight channels at 96k. So Rick, there's USB 3 on it, and I know that I know that Windows users get really grumpy when they see Thunderbolt interfaces coming out. Were you thinking about your Windows users when you put USB 3 well, on it? You know, the beauty of USB 3 is that it's on Macs and it's on PCs, and so there's no muss, no fuss. I mean, even the latest MacBook doesn't have Thunderbolt; it has USB 3. So um, yes, we were thinking about Windows guys as well as Mac guys. But the other thing that's really unique about the Studio 192 is that it has DSP uh, processing on board that handles all of the uh, input monitoring with no latency. But in addition, we also have eight FAT channels available. So a FAT channel is basically the DSP section from the Studio Live console. You've got a Few fully, track in. fully parametric, parametric EQ, compressor, gate, um, on all of the analog inputs. And all of that will be basically done using the DSP processing. So, you know, I mean, it could be USB 1, and it doesn't care because it's a digital mixer as well that's handling all of your you know, input monitoring. So the, then we have this, ex, this second box that gives us another eight, plus a load of extra I.O. on the back. Yes, yeah, so this is uh, the Digimax DP88. So uh, you know, we were the first preamp company that actually had a product that had eight at live pipe output for eight mic freeze, the very original Digimax back in the early 2000s. Um, so basically, this is the, the newest incarnation, and it has eight Class A digitally controlled mic pre's with eight at live pipe output. So if you look at the back, you not only have eight Class A mic pre inputs with eight at out, but you also have eight analog balanced outputs with eight, at, with eight at input. So this is an A to D, D to A converter, and it does up to 96K using X, S mux. So you can plug this directly into the uh, Studio 192. But here's what's really sweet, is that you have mic inputs here, but we also put separate line inputs on a D-sub. So you can bypass the mic freeze completely, go straight to the A to D converter. And what I have in my studio, which is cool, is I have a patch bay that has D-sub on it. So I go D-sub to D-sub. Yeah. Now, any of my external mic freeze that I want to use, I can use these A to D converters directly. Yeah. And then I've got the, the also analog direct outputs as well if you just want to do a split. So for live recording, you can plug in mics here and you can go out of this into another source. So uh, you've got BNC connectors here. You've got you know uh, the, um, the uh, inputs and outputs right here as well. And you also have uh, MIDI IO as well. So price point, uh, one of them is going to set you back, what about 800 bucks? 899 for the Studio 192, and then the DP88 is 799. So for about 100 bucks a channel, you could get 25, 24 inputs That's high right. end. Yeah, so for basically 2,500 bucks, you have 24 channels of up to, you know, at 24 channels, you, they'll be up to 48K. Yep. But but you can do basically, you, know, you have complete recall over all of the mic pre settings. And it's a really cool compact rig in three rack spaces. Shipping date? Uh, this will be shipping late summer, and this will be probably early fall. So August-ish, September-ish. Wonderful. Fantastic.
Awesome. Take care.